Hello guys, um, I'm back. I'm sorry, um, the third part of the Binding of Isaac is corrupt. Um, nearly the entire video, there was like a minute of it that wasn't. Um, it was all just green, and it was all flickering yellow and green and blue. It was just insane, it was unwatchable, and the sound was like cutting off. Um, I'll try and find out why this happened. I think it could be because I was recording for like nearly half an hour straight. Um, I, I'm not sure, but um, I'll try and get this fixed for the next video, but anyways, um, enjoy part 2, um, if you want me to do more, um, you know, just leave a comment below like I've said, um, and you know, so anyways guys, uh, can't you find an item, and you want to know what it is, I was just using the wiki instead of asking me because I'm rubbish, but um, alright, continuing on, I'm pretty sure we're going to find the boss room soon, yep, there you go. Oh great, troll bomb, haha, <laughs> so funny. Right, tr uh, there, there, there. Oh, I love this, Larry Jr. This one's actually, whoa, okay. My bad, not easy to kill. I suppose I could just stand on the rocks and he would never kill me. Good plan, Jason. They would never kill you on the rocks. I suppose it's sort of like cheating, but oh well. I got the items to do it, I'm doing it. <laughs> As you can see, he is finding difficulties trying to attack me. Come at me! This is like so overpowered, I can just, just fly everywhere. There we go. Completed the level so hot. And more increased health. Which is lunch. Ah, oh, crap, I didn't see the demon room. I skipped it. Oh well. Yeah, soul hearts turn into full hearts as far as I know if you complete the level, so this is quite good when you actually get them at the end, because, you know. I'm pretty sure these bullets actually go over rocks as well too. Yeah, they do. See, it's, that's like, that's extremely helpful. It means I don't have to get in the way of stuff that I wouldn't, I would normally have to. Haha, I cheat. Again. To the next room. And to the next bit. I mean, this looks pretty easy, but I can guarantee you I probably won't make this run just because of the pure fact, like, I've never made it. And if I make it the one time I'm recording, that will surprise me like hell. Whoa! This guy's on, like, drugs or something. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. Like I said, I haven't even seen this guy before. I've seen the normal version of him, but I haven't seen this one. This one's fast. Whoa. Try and blow him up. Yay. Come at me. Oh, I run out of bombs. I need that. Attack! Attack! Oh god. I've got me in like a cycle now. Oh god. <laughs> Nearly dead. Yay. I have to kill this little midget. Right, there you go. Mum's lipstick. Range up. Okay, so now I have like... Yeah, I should have... Yeah, okay, I can go all the way across the room now. Alright, on to the next level. Ah, I'm only actually two away from the end. This hasn't happened to me before. I can... Tr you can trust me on that one. Alright, on to the next bit. Jesus. I think this is helping a lot because of the pure fact I can just literally walk over the walls. Like, I don't really have to confront any enemies directly on. Oh, I hate these goddamn things. Goddamn shooters. I don't know why, but they remind me of Plants vs. Zombies so much. Alright, there you go. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Alright, next room. Ooh, there's a challenge room, yay. Alright, I'll explain challenge rooms now. Uh, challenge rooms, you can go into them only with full health or enough soul hearts that you technically have full health which are those blue hearts to the right of me um 
they're not permanent as soon as you lose them they're sort of like gone as how life is that makes sense and uh, you can get there's a chest before it and whatever you get you get that um, but you have to defeat the things in the room to get out of it um, but I'm not gonna go for that because I normally die so much in those rooms actually you know what? I'll go for it just for the pure fact I'm meant to be showing off this game and if I don't go in there you know I'm not gonna be showing it off properly so alright screw it let's go for it Ah, ten bombs. It's actually not too bad. Probably going to die now. But... By the way, this isn't just the only thing that spawns. It spawns more stuff after this one. Yep, there you go. Oh, I hate these things. Great. Whoa. I have like some weird look now. I have like a bomb on my head, and I have like the creepiest face ever. Oh, I hate these things. They're so annoying. I don't even know how they work, but they just always shut their mouths on me, and I'm just like run into them. I think it's like the further you are away from them, like ah, come on. <laughs> See, look, and then that one open. So cheap push them together. Come on. Yay! Ah, bastard. Okay. Right. I actually didn't do too bad. I didn't lose any proper hearts, if that makes sense. Uh, okay. On to the next room. I might actually go back to the penny room after I've cleared. Just to see if they... Oh, god damn it. I hate these people. Ah. There also is secret rooms which you can find by placing bombs against walls. I think there's one in every level, if that makes sense, like every level of the basement. Um, but I, I don't know how you find them. I know there is a specific way of finding them, um, but I'm not 100% sure on how you do so. Um, I'll try and find one for you guys. I'm, I'm pretty sure they just consist of an item. Uh, normally pretty good, or money, lots of money. Um, so I'll try and find one for you. I'm just taking wild guesses at where one might be, so bear with me. Actually, I think I know where it might be. Uh, it might be there. Okay, no. That was just a wild guess. Maybe it's in the penny room. Uh, I'll go to the penny room. I might spend some stuff anyway, because I've got 18 pennies. Oh, great. That's a good plan. I'm guessing there's, like, secret bosses in some of these things. Oh, great. Fucking hopping. Whoa. God damn it. I hate you, Groot. Ah. Uh. Oh, Jesus. God damn it. He's not, like, dead, any. he? Uh, okay, it just gives you a crap ton of coins for killing him. Okay, right. That's where I thought the bomb the, the, the secret room was. Okay, no, not in that room. I'm literally going into every room trying to find this thing. Maybe it's there. I've blown up like every room now. Like, if I don't find it soon, it's gonna kill me. Yeah, we found it. Okay, what's this? Ah, uh, what the fuck? Uh, yeah. I spent like 10 bombs. Oh, wait, no. <gasps> God damn it, there was a question mark on the wall. Okay, no, I was wrong. I just, I just wasted two more bombs. Alright, I guess we'll go to the boss room. Um, yeah, I'll try and show you my. I mean, if you guys want me to do more videos on Binding of Isaac, like trying to complete it or get a mom kill, I mean, I don't mind. Um, just request it in the comments. And I know, I might, e I might even be lucky and be able to do it this game, but I doubt it. I haven't even got a space item. Like, you know, the item we for space. I'm surprised I haven't actually found one. Hopefully, I'll find one soon so I can show off what they actually do. Whoa! God damn it, man. 
Wow. Crazy. Ah, I don't know if goddamn key. Yay. This works for me. Ta-da. A heart for a coin. Considering I don't really need coins at the moment, I have a lot, then no. Uh, oh no, not him. I don't like him. He's gonna jump. I thought he normally tries to jump on you, but I must be wrong. Because it's helpful how he's stuck like in between rocks. That I don't have to go anywhere near to kill him. <laughs> 